Hey everyone, it's your Sally Coach. In this video, we will be doing the Baconian word cipher. So with that said, let's get started. The first thing we want to know is that this is usually going to be a special bonus question. So make sure to look out for that whenever you're solving this. Next, it says that it starts with P-E-O. Now this is pretty important because usually it's going to be saying like starts or like ends and maybe like these three words will be to these three letters like P-E-O, right? But it's also going to be saying somewhere every now and then in one of your tests. Now, if it ever says somewhere, you should not be doing this cipher as it takes way too long and too much reasoning. And you may need more than two people even doing one cipher. So it's better to instead of getting these special bonus points, you should be getting other aristocrats or other types of ciphers instead, because it's just going to take too long for you to actually do something about it. So now that we went over that, let's go over what to actually do once we get these letters. First, we want to decode it. So let's put this all into the binary alphabet of Baconian. So P, right? That's going to be A, B, 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 A. E is going to be double A, B, A, A. And lastly, O, A, B, B, A, B. Now that we did that, we want to match it up into our ciphertext. This ciphertext is going to be like random words, and we don't really want to look at that and we don't want to like try to understand it, we're just going to look at this as normal letters. So let's look at extra, right? So we have extra as one of our letters. Now let's take extra and put it into P. So extra is equal to P, and P is equal to A, um, A, B, 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 A. So this means that E is always going to be A in all of these areas, X is going to always be B, T is always going to be B, R is always going to be B, and A is always going to be A. Now, this is pretty hard to like try to reason with, try to like put down everywhere. It's really going to take you a long time, right? So instead of doing that, let's make a table from A to uh, Z. So D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. So this is my letter G, oh, this is G. And then we're going to take everything and put it into there. So now let's take extra, right? We have E to A. So I'm gonna find E in this table. <coughs> this one right here, T E goes to A. We have X going to B, T going to B. And lastly, we have R going to B. Next, we have A to A as well. All right, after doing that, let's do our next one. And our next one is going to be um, germs. So we have germs going to A, A, B, A, A. So G to A, E to A, which we already have, R to B, already have, and M to A. M to A. Lastly, we have S to A as well. And lastly, let's do our third letter, which is going to be O. So that's going to be S, P, L, I, T going to A, B, B, A, B, T to B, I to A, L to B, and then P to B. Uh, do I have that? Yes. P to B and S to A. We already have that as well. So now that we did that, we're going to want to fill in our letters, of course, into this actual cipher. P, E, O. So after we do that, right? We're going to look at our table. So before I go on, I want to say that this table is pretty much only useful when you're doing a state and regional level test. And whenever you get to the state level, it's pretty important that whenever you do this cipher, sometimes it's going to be randomized. So this cipher is always going to have like a pattern at the state. I mean, at the invitational or regional level. And whenever I say pattern, I mean that it's going to be something like uh, 4A and then 4Bs at once and then like another 4A or it may be like 2A and then 2B and then 2A again, something like that, right? But as we see right here, we can probably find out a pattern, but at the state, maybe national and possibly regional level, you won't be able to like find a pattern as it won't even have a pattern. It will be completely randomized. So it's important that at the state level, you try not relying on the table as much. And instead, you try filling out the different areas where you already have your letters, like in your ciphertext, and try going off of that instead. 
So now let's go back and try um, filling out the rest of our table. So let's go and see a pattern that may be forming. So right here, we can see that there is P to B and then R to B, T to B, X to B, right? And it looks like that after every single other um, uh, letter, right, we get B. So this means that we probably have a sequence that looks a little bit like this, where after every letter, it's going to be switching. So A to B, A, B, B, B right here, B, A, B, A, B. So this is going to be our table, right? So this is how we're going to be solving Baconian words. Our first step is always going to be deciphering our letters. And then after that, we're going to be going straight to our table, making our table. And then lastly, our third step is going to be filling out the rest of our ciphertext. All right, so let's now go to that third step and try solving this out. We have extra again, which is going to be taking us back to P. And then we're going to have chili. So chili is going to be um, A, B, A, B, A. So that's going to be L gets A. Now, remember, binary is in groups of five. So whenever we solve all this out, we're going in groups of five. So I'm not just going to be taking gets here. I'm going to be taking the whole thing gets A. So now let's go back to this A, A, B, A, A, E. Next, we have Goofy. A, 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 B. Offer. A, B, B, A, B. B, A, A, B, A. So, so far, what we're seeing is that it looks like the word people come and go, but something, which we're not sure about yet, scout, which is B, A, 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 B, B. Let's do cruise now. A, B, A, A, A. Now let's erase this once again. Book A. This will be B A A A A R. Then we have daily. B A A B A, which is going to be T. And we have waltz. A A B B B. So birth. This is probably going to be like days. I'll put that back just in case it's end of a word. I'm going to erase this side once again and see giants, which deciphers to A, 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 which one is N? N is B. And then we have T also going to B. So now that we have that, Next is going to be D, and then it had A, B, B, A, B, awake, that's all five, so that's going to be A, and just a few more letters left that we need to decipher, cycle, goes to be A, 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 B, A, C, oh, costs, which is A, 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 B, A, also C, like A, is going to be B, A, 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 R, and then field, going to be B A A B B U and then canoe last one A A B A A so this gives us the quotes people come and go but birthdays do accrue so that's going to be the Baconian words cipher and this is going to be the end of the video 
Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have an amazing rest.